Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Tui. Um, to first correct a couple things from the last video. Um, I forgot an Omega in the code, so that's why it didn't work. And secondly, the two jiggies that I was missing that I couldn't think of. One is the Piglet's jiggy, which we can't get, and the other is from that spaceship in the other part of Atlantis that we need to go back to, hopefully later this video. Um, if you come talk to this guy there we go his name is Chris P Bacon um, and he is evidently from Great Britain if you can tell from his shorts that have the Union Jack on them um, and basically what he's saying is he's trying to photograph the paintings on the wall of this building but every time that he goes um, down into the water his, uh, or these fish will come and attack him. And if you notice there, his camera is actually a Game Boy Color with a lens attached to it. Um, because it is quite longer than normal cameras. So yeah, it is, that is a little bit of a cameo sort of reference thing. So, what we have to do is while he's down there, um, we have to shoot these fish so that they do not eat him. This is possibly one of the hardest missions in this entire game. For years, I never, never completed this mission, and I probably won't be able to complete it very well this time around. Yeah, but basically once he reaches the bottom, these fish will start appearing, and we have to shoot them with eggs, and they appear from all directions, so you can't just like sit there and, and camp them. There's the first one, and look, there's already one that's like really close to him. And so we are just going to circle around the bottom here and attempt to hit these fish before they can get to them. Um, we have to do it for like 50 or 60 seconds or something like that. And right there, we he's getting bit. And if we can get the fish in time, which I just I couldn't, um, they will go away even if they get really close to him. Anyway, but yeah, he got bit, so we're going to have to try it again. Um, yeah, I do want to try it again, but I don't know if I have the eggs for it. I only have eight blue eggs. Um, maybe we will attempt it with some ice eggs. Yeah, but, yeah, this is a very hard mission. Um, the, th the things swim fast, and they get to them pretty quickly. Um, other than that, I mean, it's really just make sure that you, uh, that you aim pretty accurately, and you keep moving. Because if you just sit and wait for fish, um, they'll get to them. Because uh, they do come from literally every direction out of the middle of those columns. Um, so you got to be careful not to miss one. As I probably am right now. There's probably one getting pretty close to him. Yep, over there. And I don't think we're going to be able to get him. Nope. And he got bit. So I'm going to quick grab these eggs. And, uh, well... I'm just kind of wasting time now. Um, I'm going to deny his request to retry. So, I've showed you guys, guys the mission. Um, and I am actually going to probably cut the video right here and show you the end of the successful attempt. So, I will be back in a minute. Alright guys, we are back here. There's about one second left on the timer. And there we go. And I... We have completed the mission to help Chris P. Bacon um, film the inside of the walls of this building. And that was about the sixth or seventh attempt if you were, uh, if you were interested in knowing. Um, the second closest I got was, interestingly enough, the third attempt right after I stopped recording. But anyway, he will drop a jiggy for us, and we are going to go get it. And then we are going to head on over to the spaceship and get that jiggy and then we will actually um be one jiggy away from being complete with um jolly rogers lagoon and that would just be for defeating the boss um which in and of itself will be a bit of a chore i don't know this this boss isn't too bad um he's a bit difficult though anyway um if we go out, I believe it is this entrance up here, we will end up back in the opening part of the lagoon. 
where that spaceship with Kazooie's face on it was that we can now break that we have the Talon Torpedo. And... Yeah, we probably are. I'm running really low on eggs, though, so... I might have to go fill them up sometime off-screen or something. Oh, come on, I, I, I froze him. Definitely hit him in the face a couple times. There we go. Uh, it only took ten eggs. Anyway, I think we actually need ice eggs for the next part, which is unfortunate. Because um, I don't think I can get any here. Um, but I don't, I don't think we need that many. I only think we need, like, five or something. So, we are going to open this up. And hopefully I won't run out of eggs like, um, Banjo-Kazooie. Although that'd be a pretty ironic, uh, throwback. Anyway, inside the UFO spaceship, we will meet these alien-type creatures. Um, and they're going to say stuff about how they're lost and such. Um, Alpha, Beta, and Gamma, so, or Beta, so, so they're very close to the, um, Greek character names. Um, the drive unit on the ship has run out of fuel, and it is power powered by crystallized ice, but they don't have any. Well, we have crystallized ice eggs, so what we have to do is you see these four, um, things that we have to... We have to shoot ice eggs into them, basically, um, is what we have to do. And I believe we can actually just hit them all by standing on here. We only have a certain amount of time to get them all off. Um, we have to get all four off by, I don't know, 20 seconds, apparently. Um, otherwise, they'll reset. And unfortunately, I'm missing this one. There we go. Um... I can't really waste any eggs, and then there's another one, and this should be the last one. And there we go, and we have given power to the UFO. Um, in case you're wondering, that green ginger over there is actually a Minjo. Um, and there's a pretty easy way of telling whether or not um, uh, it's a Minjo or a Jinjo if you know or if you don't know. Um, Basically, if it is in any part of a level that will be inaccessible after doing something, for example, the inside of this UFO, um, because it's going to leave when we leave, uh, as soon as I find the entrance. Yeah, that is a Minjo, because we can't get back in here, so if we just happen to forget the Jinjo, we won't be able ever to uh, achieve it, or retrieve it, not achieve. Anyway, um, when they leave, there is a Jiggy underneath the ship. And they are going to leave through that very close hole. And they're going to say that their kids ejected somewhere over a snowy mountain. Uh, that is a later level. We won't get there for a little bit. But yes, those, those aliens will be returning. Huh. Now, I am at a weird sort of spot because I can do one of two things. I can either end the video here at a very short uh, interval of time, or I can attempt to go and defeat the boss of Jolly Roger's Lagoon. What I think I'm going to do, since we only have about, uh, about six or seven minutes, um, I'm actually probably going to end the video here really short, um, and I will just upload an extra, extra part today. Um, on top of this normal upload. So, yeah, unfortunately, we're gonna end this kinda, kinda early, but, uh, I will see you guys in the next part, which should be uploaded rather soon. Thanks for watching.